Okay. Uh, me, I just want to comment uh, about uh, our current situation. Mm. And uh, according to my opinion, um, people are saying that Lungu should come back. Mm. Yes, it might be. Uh, uh, Welcome Wilson's YouTube family. As promised, we've got a thrilling video for you today. Make sure to stick around until the end. You won't want to miss out on what happened. Mm. And we can't deny that by UPND, or by UPND in our field. Mm. By UPND, it's true, they have failed. Mm. Lungu, in terms of uh, police, from, uh, I'm a policy, yako yale panga, yale panga po sensu kuchita, is far much better than them. Mm. But again, me, my contribution is that, me, I'm, I'm worried. I think it, in Zambia, as we stand now, mm. somehow we have re leadership crisis. Mm. We don't have leaders. Mm. Because it is very sad and it is very shameful to a country like Zambia to be having to be in a situation whereby the ruling government, the UPND government, is only afraid of PF. Mm. Of which the PF Navena, quite all right, yeah, they might bounce back, but the PF Navena, they missed up things. Mm. And Mr. Tayari, if you can be honest with yourself, even you, they mm. missed you up. Mm. You were persecuted mm. terribly, mm. even you yourself. Mm. You were one of the people who experienced the the the, 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 the yeah mm. the roughness of of the UPND of the of the PF. I I, I think he, I I think he, I'm one of those people. For me, I've suffered both. Could be a PF. Could be a UPND. Yeah. I don't think there is somebody yeah. who has suffered as much as I suffered. Could be a PF. And I don't think there is anyone who has suffered as much as I have suffered with by UPND. So you are right there, actually. Mm. <laughs> and now, what I'm trying to say is this. Mm. UPND might bounce back. Mm. But again, that's their... That's their, what, that's their school of thought in terms of governing. Mm. So, and again, again, we have a problem where UPND has also failed. Mm. Mm. UPND has failed. Mm. Now, it is very, it's very unfortunate to, mm. to, to, to be in a situation. We should have some other potential leaders. Mm. I mm. think they should, they, we should also have some other potential leaders with the, with, with visions, yeah, we have a lot of numbers, it stand now. No one has ever come out, if you have a lot of numbers, if you have a lot of numbers, at least showing you where you, you, you are going. Mm -hmm. So, me, I'm, I think that, that, that was my contribution. Yes. Okay, my brother, let me respond. Hi, thank you very much. So, please, allow me to talk about um, a number of issues that have arisen. There is an issue over the Member of Parliament for... Um, um, what is that? Is it Mambinima? Um, Jin Chisenga. And then we have uh, the issue of um, uh, why have I changed? Because, you know, uh, for the past few months, I was supporting UPND. How come I've changed? Then there is an issue of, uh, I mean, unity of purpose. I mean, things are bad. Why don't we come together and, uh, you know, uh, uh, unite? Um, then there is an issue of ECL. You know, um, basically the comments um, of Sean Tembo. Uh, Sean Tembo is saying, I mean, what is Lungu coming to do, which he didn't do? You know, then of course, you know, there is a, the issue of uh, these young politicians and uh, how they perceive uh, elections. Then of course, um, I'm not going to pick, I'm not going to pick, I just want to put on silence so that... Uh, I can respond to these issues. So now, let me start with the, what do I think about the action of uh, Jean uh, Chisenga. Uh, she's a member of parliament for, is it where? where no, at, yeah, because Anyway, the member of parliament for uh, the uh, Jean Chisenga, what is... Um, yeah, the 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 the, the 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 constituency is going, you know. You know that thing where you are trying to remember a thing and then the the name is just going anyway. A hey, Mambirima, yeah, the member of parliament for Mambirima, the member of parliament for Mambirima. What is my comment? 
frankly speaking, uh, for me, that is how it should be. Members of parliament must be able to exercise their right to express themselves. So, for me, I commend the honorable member of Mambirima. I commend her. And I'm very disappointed because today I actually got more details on what the president said. The president, you know, when he was walking towards her, he was upset and he charged towards her and he said, this is indiscipline. How can you call me a liar? The president said that. This is indiscipline. But there was nothing indiscipline about the conduct of the member of parliament. If you look at how other members of parliament conduct themselves, including Britain, including the Senate in America, you see, you watch how they grill, you know, their opponents or their opposition. You see how they grill. You see what they say. Now, the problem that we have in this government, they want to turn the members of parliament like school children. They are acting like, you know, like it's a boarding school. And Vaneli Muti, she's a matron who wants to uh, uh, chast chastise the, 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 the members of parliament. You, you cannot be scolding members of parliament, gagging members of parliament. It is wrong. It is wrong. Look at, look at what happens in, in, in South Africa. Eh? In South Africa, it is even hot. But go even more Britain. Watch what happens, you know, in the House of Commons. What happens there? Watch. There is serious debate here. And people express themselves. But in Parliament, yes, we want to make it like it's a, it's a boarding school where people have to be restricted. So that woman, what she said was very good. She expressed herself. Because in parliament, you have to speak. You have to say what you think. You have to express yourself. And that's why they have been given immunity. In parliament, they have been given immunity. Why they have been given immunity is because they want them to express themselves. They want them to say whatever, whatever they have to say and not to, be, not to face the law when they go outside. So that is nothing but the kind of parliament that we should have. Look, look, in South Africa. If you've enjoyed the today's content, is told off, have you subscribed even yet? In Namibia, you know, subscribe the, 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 the like and I, share, I share some of the clips are the keys so to becoming an integral part of, of our growing uh, family. Other countries. In Hit terms that of subscribe parliament. button, I'll share some of these give clips. us a thumbs up, um, and tomorrow. don't forget to share the love share with your friends and family. Uh, you Stay know, just tuned to show you for the next video dropping tomorrow. Thank you for being a part party. of Wilson's whether YouTube family. Whether it's the minister, family. whether it's the president, they take them on. But Bahaka in the Ichirema yesterday, or, or the, on that day, not yesterday, was it yesterday? Yes, it was yesterday. Today is what? Today is Saturday. Bahaka in the Ichirema wali fuluwa, and went to her, you know, to try and intimidate her, to say that is indiscipline. There is nothing here like indiscipline. You are a liar. You are a liar. So, umuntu nga you are a liar. You are a liar. There is nothing indiscipline about it. There is only the truth. And this is what we are suffering. When we tell them the truth, they get upset. They start bringing charges. They start bringing guns to our house. They start breaking into our house. And that is a dictatorship that I've been talking about. And imu I told you at the beginning, even before Waka Inde Chirima came into power, I used to say that this man is a dictator. I used to say it. Except that the PF now over this Akulemi Tue, which made me at the end of the day say, let them just, let Waka Inde Chirima himself go in. Because the PF Vali Akulemi Tue. And I want you, me I'm aging, when I talk here, I talk so that you people can can, can, can realize and do something about it. No matter how much you if may want to pretend. If you've enjoyed today's content, no have matter you subscribed how much you may yet? Want to pretend, including you, subscribing, liking, and sharing 
Are they close to becoming an integral part of our growing family? Look at how many people Hit that are patronizing button, Kuma Kote. Give us Kuma a thumbs up. Kote, and don't Kote, forget to Kote, share the love with your friends and family. Stay tuned for the next video yeah. dropping there is tomorrow. An epidemic Thank you and for being now, a part this is of an Wilson's epidemic YouTube that I family. Kuri eh? kuri korela, now, mumushi, and people are just going there. That is how our courts have become. And then, unfortunately, even our courts... You know, you can say, no, you are hoping for justice. But our courts are compromised. We are very good magistrates and very, very good judges. But this government ha has taken over everything. They have instilled the fear in our magistrates. They have instilled fear in our, uh, in our judges, which is very wrong. And you see, this is, it brings me down to the next question. Where my brother, so I think I've answered you, my brother, to say, what he, that member of parliament for Mambilima did, that is how it should be. And I'm encouraging members of parliament that Muirati, now you are voted by the people. Neri Mutu was not voted. Neri Mutu cannot even win an election. She can't win an election. Even she powered, she can't win. She has never won an election. Eh? Even in the United to State Council, Neri Mutu, what has she con contributed to the jurisprudence? What has she contributed? What has she contributed? Ten to money, ama cases were nearly muti over the act. Eh? Where she represented people. The only case that she represented people, Vadi Yanenda Rama Shamanan Kane, Shama, Ishamanan Kane, Isha, Avama, Amaritaris, Kachina Maritaris, Namari Trenches. Eh? So there is nothing honorable about Vanelli Muti in terms of law. But because Vaka in the HMA is in power, he has conferred on her at State Council. State Council, Yabu Puba. State Council ya abu upuwa tayinole remo kwa awawe ni bana nika natiwa nani wa haimbe fish wa chita we have got senior lawyers senior lawyers senior lawyers senior lawyers they are not state councils number one state council wa wata in the HLM as long as you are a president senior kuku pea state council state council state council some of the lawyers that way that go to that state council tapali nama cases wa wata chita handle State Council is a recognition of that. This is what you have contributed. You have contributed, you have contributed to shape the law of our country. But case parliament. Finch parliament. Finch. What is she doing? She just acts like he, like, he, like, like a, the headmistress at a boarding school. Eh? She thinks she's the headmistress there. Those people, Wakal and Babala, they were voted by people. They go to parliament re representing people, thousands of people, which Baneri Muti can never convince. She must give them respect. Naimove never HH, you must give them respect. That is in discipline. That is nonsense. In discipline is what you did to go and intimidate her because you are a president. And I know, I know for sure some, some useless members of parliament will rise on point of order so that she can be punished. But you are turning our country into a dictatorship. That's all you are doing. You are making our country into a dictatorship. And you Zambians have got a responsibility. To, 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 to frown upon this, to reject dictatorship. One time we should be able to protest against Neri Muti. One time we should be able to protest against Neri Muti. Because protests are part of democracy. We should start, you know, mobilizing ourselves, you know, and start protesting against some of these uh, dictatorship. I know they will refuse. I know you have confrontation with police and whatever, whatever. But sometimes... Uh, we must get serious. We must get upset. We should not just continue status quo, status quo. No, we should not continue. Anyway, getting back to the to getting to the question to why did I change? Because I was supporting them. Yes, I was not even saying these things. Frankly speaking, these are politics, and I even said it. You know, I'm a politics for I'm a politics. You know, I, 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 I've come to learn that principle really doesn't sell in politics. <laughs> Unfortunately, principled really doesn't sell in politics. And the people who are principled, people who follow like, you know, uh, 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 the Bible, 
I mean, I'll talk about religion. I'll talk about, you know, Christianity, for example. Because this is what I struggle with myself. Me, I'm quite strong in terms of my religion, in terms of my Christianity. And I strive to be a good person. I strive, you know, to, to, to follow some, some morality, you know. Of course, not quite my weaknesses, and especially my skate, not quite a problem. But anyway, I try to be, you know, to try to be a good person, to try and do the right thing. Now, my politics was angry. You know, if my friend can't go to conquer, if you conquer, we know we know so. Was angry. If you go with that route, the very people that you are trying to protect, they will stone you and whatever and whatever, whatever. And then, so. So, one for your point, the first point is that I'm describing the difficulty in politics when you talk about principle and morality. In one situation, for example, there are situations whereby that's what people want. And when you are a politician, it becomes very difficult to really go against the popularity. Because politics is about numbers. Politics is about the majority. So, you went, now, but this is not right. And you are a politician. To come around and say, uh-uh, not this, it's very difficult. I can give you one, one contentious issue. is the issue of gayism. The issue of gayism. A lot of, uh, a lot of people, LGBTQ, a lot of politicians, including Waka in the Ichilema, they do recognize this issue. But in Zambia, in Ghana, Zambia, you accept LGBTQ. You are in problems as a politician. So that's why you see Waka in the Ichilema. Waka America, no, we are supposed to embrace values. We are supposed to change and whatever. Vaisa is a Zambia, Waka Salura, Waka Salura, Waka Salura, Waka Cathedral of the Holy Ghost. No, we are not going to accept gayism. Eh? He he he's not decided why because of politics because popularly Zambians hey issue of LGBTQ is very difficult but at least for me I will tell you ah uh, Papa so I will tell you in the role of camera I will tell you that for me I I believe that there are people who are born differently me I'm going to tell you that I believe there are people who are born differently and we need to recognize them and we need to respect their rights. But this position, much as I have the courage to say it, how many politicians can say it? How many politicians can come out like that? There are very few. And I know some people denounce me for that. Some people denounce me for that. So you had Shupakama politics. So in terms of, then, then the other point is also your capacity. Your capacity uh, to do politics. So sometimes you find that, you don't have the capacity, you know. You may not even agree with certain people. But because you don't have the capacity, because they are bigger, you accept to say, okay, if you feel not achieving. So like in this case, by UPND for me. By UPND, it's not that I believed in whatever nonsense that they are doing. Because it's nonsense. What Hakai in the has been doing is nonsense. But... What they did, they came heavy-handed on me. My brother, I hope you are listening, the one who asked this question. My brother, they came heavy-handed on me. Me, I was supporting by Edgar Lungu. And in them, ever fetch Shinkafe as it is, I was pushing for my Edgar Lungu. I was pushing for Alewe de Rapua agenda. If there is a patron of Alewe de Rapua agenda, it's me. All these other people, they jumped in and whatever, whatever, whatever. It's okay. But really, the first person that came out with the Alebo de Rapua agenda, it's me. Even Kuli Valungu, Valungu didn't want to come back. It's me who went and planted that in his, in his head. It's me. Valungu Tavalevo, I am a politics. He refused. It's me. I went about three times talking to Kuli Valungu to say, this is possible. But first of all, he came. Second of all, he came. Third, baby, ah, now for our language, can't he? I just went out, went out, pushed, 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 and it was fiambok monika tawe. Can't you kutifia panga sense? That's when Walungu na vera. I think kutifia bomba. But really, I started that agenda. Now, as I was pushing for Walungu, I never, I never, 
it brought pressure to the UPND. And when the UPND got that pressure, because Valungu knows, the UPND, they know that really, Haka in the HDM, I mean, I have a little bit of 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 a little of the rigging that we did, but this man managed to get 1.8. Because my elections are the same as Shinka. Lungwa will my elections. Because Ngamatimu Konke, with all these provinces, seven provinces, Akwata 1.8. Elo Ukuksaiju, Ee, Haka in the Hidem, Ukisa Akwata 1 million to beat Haka in, to beat Ed Galungu. Does that make sense? In seven provinces, Ed Galungu won with 100,000 votes. In, in, in three provinces, Haka in the Hidem won with 1 million votes. Ma votes ya kuiva. So, Haka in the HDM, I wish we Yada my elections, I live in it. Mwamfwa. Haka in the HDM knows that he stole the elections. So if he stole the elections, and then we go again for another election, and Haka Afiro Kuiva, he knows that Edgar Lungu win the elections. If these things, you can argue as much as you want, you can refuse, but facts are there. Haka in the HDM knows Edgar Lungu can win an election. So what does the UPND do? But UPND, what they did, they came heavy-handed on me. Gave me a number of cases in Dara. Such that I started going to court. Perfect Nalea three days a day. Three days a week. Three days a week. Na four days a week. Sometimes Nale Tampa Monday to Friday. There I could court. I'm arrested full full. I had cases, Mwana. I was arrested within that short time. Within that short time, when I was talking about Alewi Lapo, Alewi Lapo, I was arrested nine times. Nine times I was arrested. So, what do I do? I had no capacity. And Balungu, then I'm telling you the truth, Balungu did not help me enough. I had lawyers, but lawyers never eh? had They were tired because Benjamin Muro, for example, because he was like, um, almost every day with me. He was not attending to other cases. Bamuelo, every day, every day, he was attending if to my If you've enjoyed cases. today's content, so, have you subscribed yet? Sometimes you have to my excuse. Subscribing, of course, not liking, my excuse. and Delivery. sharing you know, are the keys they had to becoming other an integral part so, of our growing family. Hit that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and don't forget to share the love with your friends and family. And you and you and I became powerless. Stay I became tuned exposed. for the next video dropping tomorrow. I became exposed. Thank you there was one day in Dallas. Wilson's YouTube family. Kunga ndata kwa dinangu fimo. Kunga ndata kwa dinangu fimo. Ama lai takuli. Because I was not doing anything. I was not generating any money. Ndi muma seo that my wife came to see me. She had nothing at home. There was no food. There was no power. And we had even borrowed in Kongoli. I felt so bad. After Nafuma, I went to Kuliwa Lungu. Then I went to Kuliwa Now I went to Kuliwa Lungu. Now I said, Mone Nime. Balungu didn't give me money. But Esther Lungu packed things. Fia Munganda. Balunga, Balunga, Balunga. Nama vegetables. Bampela. I'm telling you, as I was going home, I felt very bad. I said, Is this the situation that I've, I've reached? You know, where. I have to go through this. I really felt very bad. I felt very bad and I had no lawyers. I had no lawyers really. You know, where you can feel to say, because I'm a lawyer. I'm a lawyer. Uli mukoti. Elo wa mo kutumina. Kanso muli kui sa. Oh, ah, there is a matter. Oh, ah, okay. Let it stand down. Okay, I'll come later. Okay. You know, it was difficult. I was overwhelmed. I was overwhelmed. Next, what came to happen, which really changed my mind, Chris Zuman Zimba Vika. Valonga Chris Zuman Zimba. For nothing, Chris Zuman Zimba did nothing. He did nothing. They knew he had not committed any crime. But Bamu Ikata Bamu Longa Chris Zuman Zimba. Okumu Vepeshe Fia Gassin. He was nowhere. There was nothing. But they just wanted to get him and put him inside. I thought to myself, 
Apanga is changing this what has happened to Chris Zuman Zimba who happened to me. And the Chris Zuman Zimba was inside. He got very little help. How you can make a person weak? I looked at Chris Zuman Zimba. He didn't get enough help. He didn't. He didn't. That is what turned my mind. I said no. And of course there were people that were talking to me. From UPND. They were telling me, Iwe, we want to work with you. Iwe, leave that man. Eh? People from State House. People from State House. I don't want to mention their names. They were talking to me. My wife left. She went to Ethiopia. She went to Ethiopia. Because of with my shan, 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 shan. And one friend, one friend from State House is the one that gave me money to buy a ticket and to go and bring back my wife. After he convinced me to say, come and work with us. And he told me, look, even your wife has left. So just come and work with us. And he organized money. He gave me money to go and bring back my wife. That's how I went and brought my wife. It is a UPND friend, one of my UPND friends from State House who helped me. Who helped me. And I went and I brought my wife. So when I came back, my wife was complaining. My wife is always against this politics. She's against to our parallel. When it comes to politics, my wife, she goes this side, I go this side. If there is a big issue that is a problem between me and my wife, is politics. She really goes the other side, me, I go this side. And so, even when I was bringing her back, I was convincing her to say, no, 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 I'm not going to fight, I'm not going to be fighting with the, with the, with, uh, for Alebuerirapu. And she clearly told me, you, you are fighting for Alebuerirapu, Alebuerirapu, but it, this Alebuerirapu is just bringing problems for you. What is the point? That's how I left it. That's how I said, and when she came back, I had to. But what I did, Instead of me being a praise singer, at least I went quiet. There were certain things that I came out, but see, mostly I was quiet. Mostly I was quiet. So my brother, that is how I went to UPND. I didn't go to UPND because of it is the pressure that was there and I didn't get enough help. So that is how I said, okay, let me give up. I gave up and I gave myself a UPND. And when I gave myself to UPND, I thought things are now going to be okay. We are going to work together, whatever, 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 whatever. And we discussed the cases. I told them, my brothers, me, I want to work with you. But how am I going to work with you when I'm not free in my mind? When every day, there come a court, whatever, whatever. So please, na papa, UPND, look into these cases. These cases are political. I've not stolen. I've not stolen. The cases that I have are political. They are just political, that's all. And I told my friends, I met a number of people, a number of people, a number of people, but I would never mention their names here. But now I should. Yes, we discussed these, these issues. Up to Baaka in the Ichiri Mabari Shive. Up to Baaka in the Ichiri Mabari Shive. Because some people that were coming twice were sent by Baaka in the Ichiri. Now, if one of you not here, how long do you think you are? Kuisa. Yeah. Ama cases, yale afie. Yale afie. Gilbert Pili, ali, mm. No, no. Ninu hao, ukukonsoku. But Gilbert Pili, ali, no. Ali afie nama cases yako. Ali afie nama cases yako. At the end of the day, not that Gilbert Pili was not being spoken to. He was being spoken to. Allah, he was being spoken to. And the promises were coming up to say things will be okay. Wala mdala. Iyo asoti ya isa. Asoti, a police officer I never assaulted. I was convicted. But I didn't, com I didn't commit that crime. But the good magistrate, she was under pressure to convict me. She was under pressure to convict me. She knew if she let me go, she was going to be in problems. She knew if she was going to let me go, she was going to be in problems. How do you say, umuntu at no, a, a, a medical report, no, the medical report didn't show anything, but it is just for collaboration. People, witnesses said they saw her, swollen. 
How can you rely on witnesses who were forced to come to police back up to come and to come and testify against me? Are those witnesses you can call? These are witnesses. People who work with the with the, with this police officer, there were no other independent witnesses apart from Bakapokola. There was nothing independent to prove that I assaulted that police officer because even the medical report didn't prove anything. But I was convicted. But I'm sure the God that lives in that woman, that beautiful woman, she's very beautiful, by the way, a very beautiful magistrate. The God who lives in that beautiful magistrate said, no, okay, you will pay. You will pay 20,000 kwacha before the end of the day. If you don't pay before the end of the day, you will go in for nine months. Now, uh, it is 11 hours. But I have a judgment. 11 hours, but I have a judgment. I'm a bank. If they find you, you have to go and deposit money in a bank, in a Zanako bank account. The banks close at 14 hours. And you need to get 20,000 kwacha. I, my wife started running around to look for, for that 20,000 kwacha. Valungu head of it and quickly sent a 20,000 kwacha. I was, that, that is how I paid and I came out. Now, after Fiapitev, what, what did the UPND do? What did Gilbert Piri do? He goes and appeal. Meanwhile, Banasun Kanama cases Yambiuko. Kwali wa kesi ya mutini, kwali wa makese ya ya nanika de ya eh, achani, ati, ati nshiyo, eh, ati achani, inciting, uh, inciting mutiny, then kwa sabana seditious practice, seditious intention. If my case is if kuru fikul, but what if you pushing? I said, what is this nonsense now? So nangudi mwavo, you people who like to say, no you flip flop, you flip flop. I flip flopped. I went to UPND because UPND gave me my cases if and I didn't get the help that I needed from 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 the PF. And I'm saying this so that Mwishive because my item of a person, hey, the PF, hey, the PF, the PF, the PF. You like you you imagine things, hey, Valungu, Valungu, hey, now I'm paying five hundred thousand kwacha. Then you have a fishing cap, Mwishive. Then you have a fishing cap, Mwishive. How was I supposed? How could I fight? I couldn't fight. I was let down. I was let down by the PF. I was let down by the PF. And the PF in Gabali Mfuide. The if I would have come out, Sampa wouldn't have been there. It wouldn't have been there if Balungu had come out at the time when I was saying Balungu come out, Balungu come out. If I would have come Sampa wouldn't have done what the nonsense that he that that he has done. By today. Because he can't pay twice, by today, he can't pay twice, he can't pay twice, he can't pay twice, he can't pay twice, he can't pay I gave myself, but they couldn't embrace me. So I'm going to say, I'm going to UPND. Muleke, muleke. It's not me. It is your, your, your foolish leaders. It is your foolish leaders who could not, you know, embrace me. And ni mpe na nomba, ni mpe na ni mpe na mde michita kantu. Mde michita kantu, mde michita kantu. Nga mulefika koku 2026. Nga mulefika koku 2026. Mule tolo wapona. Nde michita kantu, elo nshila tampa, nshila tampa, nde isa, nde isa nshila tampa, nde isa nshila tampa wa UPND, mwala muna, ichale nguwe, ichale nguwe, ichale nguwe, ichale nguwe, ichale nguwe, ichale nguwe, eh, bokos, mwala chumona, mwala chumona, I gave myself, I gave myself into your hands, like somebody said that you have created a monster, but UPND you have created a monster in me, I gave myself to you, Nai pera, eh? Nai pera. Kwat riule ba riule ba 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 ba
Ime mune mwana kwa tumwadisa mbili ramu wadisho tapati nefo mudi. Mune chumuna. Elo iwa Gilbert Piri. Amangu, ama DPP wonsa hawa afumako. Mutembo nchito, I didn't agree. I didn't agree. Totally it was nonsense. I didn't agree. E, uyu nituwa nikane siyuni, I didn't agree. But Mutembo nchito, I have no issue with Mutembo nchito. He was just doing a job. Siyuni, Siyuni was one of those people who was pushing her. Ama cases muli balungu. But wane, whatever was happening, I didn't agree. I fought, I fought for Siyuni. But you were Gilbert Piri. When the time will come, I will be one of those people that will launch a complaint against you. Whether it is my, it will be malicious or whatever, whatever. If you are okay, you are a useless guy. You are a useless guy. Who she tasha? Tau tasha. Ala, tau tasha. Me, I stood by you. I stood by you. Eh? I stood by you. If ero ine ngana imish ngana imino muntu ngana imino muntu fira fira pangi kamdala fira pangi ka I've got influence nangu musawa yati yo tayari shanja shanja ngana ku imina fie fira pangi ka epo na ikata para moneja tayari ikata puapu ngana ikata periash nangu niwa soroch muteka nyefi nde chita fe sparing ni sparing ni shirifo kulanda sana pantu Na ine palasti kutu wa sanga chan 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 But otherwise <laughs> So ronchi nga ninku imisha kanti uwe nomba Nde, nde kucharira nde, Ndela nda ami komandi Nde kushamu Nde kushamu pantu na ine ndi mwa ume You know mwa ume Mwa ume tari ngoku imino mwa ume muna nkwe sana Kui uwera mu So nde kushamu But nga ninku imina So iwe Gilbert Piri Iwe Gilbert Piri Ao oh. Tuakula, tuakula pitamu, tuakula pitamu. Ninji shiba mule mfuwa, if you ndela nda paso mule mfuwa, but mule pelefe, you won't get me. You won't get me, instead it's you I'm going to get. And I'm telling you, I'm promising you, it's you I'm going to get. It's you I'm going to get. Mwalitu mpasan. I gave myself to you. Elu mwansa mule nchita wanyawan. So anyway, my brother, wa, now, now we cut off your power, a power soft. I'm just telling you why I came back to the UPND. And they have come full throat. They came with full throat. Eh? Ukuya mungandu, ukuya mkula, ukutowa ulo, ukutowa ulo, ukutowa ulo, kwa tininganda ya ago. Eh? Ukuya toba ule mwa, toba ule mwa, toba ule, you steal things, you get things. Who is going to, 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 to give me those, back those things that you, that you took? Eh? And some of you, mwa, baka pokula, you have, mwa, nishwe nyanda ya ndi yonse. Eh? Mwalishwa na mbedi opo ndala, shani, shani. Inga ndoku isalwa fe, in, inside and out, mwa, mwa, mwa isalwa. Ala, hey, anyway, it's okay. It's okay, but I always pray that, you know, I don't have, I don't have to be vengeful. And I know some of you police officers, wami tu mafie, ni buungwele fie, mu, 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 you, ni mwe wa kuwe. You are bloody cowards, some of you police officers. You are bloody cowards. You know that what you are, what is happening is the wrong thing, but you can't you can't do anything. But it's okay, it's okay. I do understand you. I do understand you. I will be in government, but I will not come for you. So basically, that is why I changed. That is why I changed. Now, so what is my agenda now? My agenda now. That is the that is my agenda. Afuiro kuya, afuiro kuya, na kufiro, afuiro kuya, pantu na afirwa. Na afirwa, echo afuiro kuila. Elo na kwa ta, you know, he wants, he's using the state insurance. Echo mpatire sana ina haka inde HLM. I'm not even pretending. Echo mpatire haka inde HLM because he's using the state institutions. Instead of using himself, eh? he's using state institutions. He's destroying wakapokola, he's destroying ama courts. Is destroying parliament. So where are we? Where, where are we? What has remained of us? If a president messes up the police, messes up the courts, messes up parliament, what has remained? Don't even talk about parastatos. Nama parastato yonse abikireko abantu wakoba kandiri. So where is our country remaining? Ama minds ale ishtisha. I will talk about these things. How can they change minds? Buying those minds. Is getting those minds. I told you that you muntu ya kawera. A kawera nanikani full throttle. Full throttle to privatize the country. 
How can the HNMA doesn't even care whether he's going to win AMA elections in 2026? Because he's going to make sure that the economy of the, of the country is in his hands. Is in his hands. Whoever is going to take over, he has to make sure that he liberates Zambia from Haka in the Ichirima because Haka in the Ichirima, the same way that he did privatization, that is what he's doing. Anyway, I'm responding to your answers. I'm responding to your question. Why I moved away. Now, let me talk about Sean Tembo. And in their land, whatever, whatever. You know, why had Kalungu Bali Kwatama weaknesses here? And even if in their land, you, you are able to pick the weaknesses. You are able to pick the weaknesses. PF is where it is today because of Bayed Galungo. If Bayed Galungo had come out at the right time, the situation wouldn't be the, wouldn't be the way it is. If Bayed Galungo had come out at that time, when the iron was hot, if he had come out, the situation wouldn't be where it is. Bayed Galungo, but he was slow. But he was slow, he pushing him into and that is his character anyway. To Alipusana, in and about Edgarungu, not Pusana. In and I fast in that. Now, I fast, kiriki, kiriki, sometimes, in the Fumana offside. Of course, everything has got its positive side. Balungu, but you slow. In and I fast. But, was that Muni fast, and sometimes, in the Fuma offside. Now, Fipenya. Balungu, but you slow. Muni slowness, Yabona, you know, there is something that is good. You know, he when he makes a decision, it is a good decision. But sometimes it's too slow, such that he, he allows the foolishness of people uh, of of, of Mao Sampa to manifest. You see the difference. He's slow, and in his slowness, sometimes yes, it's good. He handles things carefully, but sometimes he's too slow, such that he allows foolishness to happen. Like the foolishness which was happening when we had Galungo was in state house. But Kalungu, when he was in state house, people talk about the corruption, 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 corruption. Tamata la unfapo umuntu umo uwa lumbula wa Edgarungu in corruption. People use the presidency, yawa Edgarungu, to do a lot of stupid things. Avena Kaiza Zulu, Avena Amos Chanda. They did a lot of stupid things in the name of the presidency. And that is a weakness. That is a weakness. Now, in spite of these weaknesses, and in their end, I'm telling you the truthful, truthfully, in spite of these weaknesses, when you look around, when you look around today, I'm telling you, we don't have anybody better to lead Zambia after Haka in the Ichirima. We don't have. We don't have anybody better to lead Zambia after Haka in the Ichirima than Edgar Lungu. Tembo. I mean, Sean Tembo, Sean Tembo, even if I'm in my elections, even a Sean Tembo, <laughs> he, he wouldn't even get 20% of the votes that I can get. So I want to say, politically, I'm also a president of a political party, and I also want to become a president. Why am I, why am I not saying, let me be the president? Why? Why? Because I can also start doing that. Hello, I can do it, and I, I can do it much better than any of the, these politicians that are talking in the country. I can do much better. Why is it that I am saying, let Balungu lead? And I'm not even putting myself, Kuliba, Uka, and whatever, whatever. I'm speaking independently. I'm speaking independently. I'm speaking my mind. Chishinka. At the moment, in spite of the weaknesses of Balungu, which I have even suffered from myself, I suffered, you know, out of the weaknesses of Vaed Galungu, I suffered. But in spite of those weaknesses, we don't have any better person to lead Zambia than, than Ed Galungu. The next person that comes close, Kuri Balungu, is Brani Mundubi. That's the next person who comes close. Close, Kuliba Lungu. It's Brani Mundubi. But Brani Mundubi doesn't have the experience that Balungu has. I want to give you now why I am saying that Balungu is the best person. Number one, experience is the best teacher. Balungu, now I am Bilila, Pari experience, now I am Tolamo Kamo. Now I am Tolamo Kamo Balungu. 
If Barungu comes back as president, in them he will not be the same. He will not be the same. Now I told him, come on, now I say, Mbirira. Because, Padia, Bari Pakla would deny him. Bari Mfwake will. No, but now I was in English. Now I was like, oh, I want to bala furula. Ngata uwa sendere wino bala furula. Barungu now I say, Mbirira. Barungu kwa chitafida wale wale wa chitapa. Ukisa nama nanikane, nama, nama grinder. Kwe, 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 kwe. You think he, he likes that? Look how he has been humiliated. Look how he has been reduced. Eh? He goes para ni kani para para force headquarters. You he comes up with phones and say no 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 no. Go go to central police. Eh? Na ba sa mbili na ba tola mo kamonde mieva. And that experience yawa rungu tapali u yikwete. Tapali u yikwete. Na H H na E na ngaf mapo akai kwata ida experience. Aka ikwata ile experience. But you see, some people say, wise people say that, wise people learn from the experience of others, but the foolish ones learn from their own experience. But HH, instead of learning from the experience, yawa, yawa, yawa lungu, he's not learning. He's not learning. But he will face it very soon. So, ndem yewe chishinka, I'm not saying this for anything or whatever, whatever. And then we chishinka. Valungu is the best person. Ni me have my weaknesses, yawo. Me, I suffered during the time of Valungu. I campaigned against Valungu. Mu 2020, 2021. I campaigned against him. Because Vaishiren Jikata, three months before the elections, Van Jikata. And they were busy, they were determined to send me to prison. They were determined to send me to prison. And when I came out, I said, no. It won't happen. It won't happen. I'm not going to prison. And the only way I was going to survive is to make sure that Barungu wa pona. And Vali pone ne. Na ba HH waka pona. Nde miewa. Ba HH waka pona. But to replace ba HH, the best bet we have is ba Edgar Lungu. And one of the first things is that na ba kwa ta experience. Na ba kwa ta experience. Ba Lungu will not be the same. Then ya wawa shon tembo wale wat. No. Finch wa kesa chita. Ukwa wula nituwa nikani. Sean Tembo, uh, 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 these are, uh, they, they, are, they are political infants. They are political infants, political uh, teenagers. Political teenagers. Because in my politics, I'm going to move forward with Peter. And I want to to Leland, and I want to be a Kumfwa, and I want to be a Kumfwa, and I want to be a Kumfwa, to be president. Charlie Shupa to be president. Charlie Shupa. But I'm going to be a Kumfwa, and 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 I'm He's coming to stabilize the country. We need somebody who can stabilize the country. There is a lot of mess. And we need somebody who can stabilize. Somebody mature. I'll give you an example. I'll give you an example of why we need somebody mature like Valungu. Why we need somebody mature like Valungu. You see, by HH now it's that, now it's that divide each other. By HH has created, has created hatred among us Zambians. A lot of Zambians, but they have inhibited hatred, especially on this tribal or regional, on regionalism, tribalism and regionalism. But I want to refer to Yokulanda. Musivu service, the muli division, muli division, muli wakapokola, muli division, ikulu. In the country, no mbango wa monafio nankane, I went to open a bank account. I went to open a bank account with, with one of these stupid banks at, 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 at China, Stanbik. Stanbik. I give everything, everything, and they tell me, no, go and bring, go and bring Ishi. Go and bring uh, uh, at the source of your income. I go and print my statement, my personal statement, bank statement, not one. At no, three four from a business. I was upset. And you know, looking just at the name, when I saw the name, I felt like Uyumu Anakashiwa Alenga, it's because of this person. You see? But then, when I sat back, I said, no, I mean, this might just be a bank policy. It's not this person. But because of the name, I associated the foolishness of that bank because it's foolish. It's really foolish. Stanbic is one of the stupid banks. One of the stupid banks, a foolish bank. It's a foolish bank, Stanbic. I mean, it's stupid to ask people to go, go and show us the source of whatever. I'm opening a, a company which doesn't even need capital. 
which doesn't even need capital. I don't need capital. I don't need money to open the business that I opened. Which Shabalata as an agent, a person pays me money. I go and buy a Malata Do I need anything? But then this stupid bank is telling me, bring, go and uh, bring a source of money. I am opening a business so that I can make money. So how can this stupid bank be asking me, Kabiya Kade Toko Oko Afumye Ndarama? Ni Ndarama ish? Alachi stand by ki muli fi puba. Muli fi puba, you are a stupid bank. But anyway, the point is that, because of the woman who was the name which was there, you know, I felt like, Bimini Chichi Na Chima Yocha Alinga. If you want to fear you you see? But then I say, well, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to you, and surely, surely, I, I am doing a lot to resist, to look at names. But a lot of people are looking at names now. We are now looking at names. Something that was not there in the past. The fortunate thing is that, you know, I've got a lot of friends. Most of my friends, they are from Southern Province. Most of my friends, they are from Southern Province. A lot of them, they are from Southern Province. Even my confidence, confidence, the people that I tell my secrets and whatever, whatever, they are from Southern Province. So I know that it's not everybody from Southern Province or from whatever, whatever, whatever. Now, Yui, I don't think Yui looks at me as a, a member. Me and Yui, I think we are cool. If me and Yui, I think we are cool. In inch of Yui, not what inch to shupa. And he has to protect that job. That's why he can be hard on me. But really, I know you, wherever he is, he knows deep down his heart to say, no, that guy is okay. We are okay. So, unfortunately, but this is there. This is there. So you need a leader that will not come to say, now to Aisa, to Alami Fulula. You see? If we, we, we get a leader like that one, at number two, Aisa, to Alami Fulula, the country will be more divided. Because that kind of a leader, like I know one member of parliament, my elections, UPND, Ikakwata Convention, Ikamera Kumalole. There's one friend of mine, he's an MP. He was saying that Ikamera Kunanikane Convention, yeah, UPND, to remove whoever will be president, you know, taking over, uh, you know, speaking from what Mao Zampa has done. At Inenka Itwala Kuna Nikani, Kuna Northern Province, Eko Ika Avera Convention, Ya UPND, Uku Fumiapo Haka Inde Ichirim. But you see, that will, will, that can be terrible for our country. So we need a person who got the temperament here Valungu. Because Valungu, in spite of him coming from Eastern Province and whatever, 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 you cannot accuse Valungu of tribalism. Valungu, yes, tribalism has been there. Arabi was accused of tribalism. Sata was accused of tribalism. Mwanawasa was accused of tribalism. Valungu is the only president that was not accused of tribalism. And indeed, he has got that temperament that can unite, unify the country. So we need a president that can unify the country. Valungu suits that characteristics. He suits that characteristic whereby... Because Valungunga was a tabaka, he said, Hey, Imo, Fumeni Kavien, Imo, uh uh. No. At least he's like that. So we need a person like Valungu for that. To unite the country. We need somebody that is mature to unite the country. Not Uri eh, Ovazira Squat Ninevo. Eh? Nganiwa Shon Tembo West. Eh? Nganiwa Shon Tembo West. So really, Vashon Tembo, I mean, let him just sit down. Let him just sit down. He doesn't even know what he's talking about. If not, if not uh, Ed Galungu, then who? Then who? Eh? Because those, they don't even come close. Nangwai mini, they don't even come. Who? Who? Eh? So, Lungu at the moment is, is good. At least he can unify the country. The other issue, Lungu alikuwa toluse. If things are so bad, Muzambia, because waka in the matapa kwa toluse kuma Zambians. Haka inde ichilema is a capitalist. is a cold-blooded capitalist. Ala ila tona no kutona capitalist. Ndala nga, nga lenda. Ichiwe chako af, af, afuka ni capitalism. He doesn't care about human beings. He doesn't. As long as he's making money, that's it. But Valungu, 
is a good person. He's a good person. And I can give you an example because me, I back up my position, my, my, my points. The issue of IMF, Valungu, Valu Apati, the Pokuni, Western, the, the Western countries. The Western countries hated Valungu because on, of two things. The way he was coming out, Pari Geizim, actually, three things. The way he was coming out, Pari Geizim, because Valungu was unequivocally, eh, 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 equivocally, he was just coming out very clear on Geizim. No, I don't want this. Then number two, the IMF, he clearly told IMF, they can be, we will, we will, we will manage. And the, the, the Western community were not okay. And then number three, he embraced the Chinese. These are the three things that made him to be hated by the Western communities. So, but these things that he did, he did them for, the, for Zambia. Gaism, it's because Zambians believe in this. In terms of uh, IMF, he knew that this suffering that is currently going on, we will come to Zambians if I agree with the IMF conditions. HH has accepted and look how we are suffering now. So at least Valungu has got that heart. And we need that kind of a leader who can be able to slow down in implementing some of these policies and find other ways of surviving. Valungu ni malawa kwa tiko, uriyo mfiashu, uriyo uruisha, 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 oke to life tako so, oke chen, chuteko tuma diru, oke shan, 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 efo wa Valungu. So at least we need him. We need, we need that kind of thing. Then what about the weaknesses? What about the weaknesses? Eh? Like somebody has said, ah, Balungu na vena yu, whatever, whatever, yes, he has got a problem. Somebody was, talking, was saying that. It's true. What about the weaknesses? Ayama weaknesses, Yawa Lungu, that's why some of us now, we have to make sure that we are part of government. Ine, Ine, I am, I, I, I don't think Balungu will leave me out of government. I don't think, and I want, I want to be very close to him. I want to be very, very close to him. And I can assure you that I will not miss my weights. So we will support Valungu by making sure that he does the right thing. Because me, I will definitely be Valungu. And I want to be very close. Close, like I don't even want to be chance. I want to be close. And even if I'm pay I'm practicing now. Ndela ndama weaknesses ya walungu. Not that inchila ndana. Ndem yewe chinka. I talk kuri walungu. I talk. Tula landa. But he will tell you I don't miss my ways. What I don't agree, I don't agree. I do. Napano pene ndela nda publicly. Ndela nda. He has helped me. He's the one that paid 20,000 kwacha. Even he. Apa when I was. Uh, when, I'm, when I'm out. He sent money to, to, to my wife. It's true. He's helping me. But I'm not going to be a praise singer, to be a yes buana, yes buana. No. That's why I'm talking about the weaknesses. And one thing that I've appreciated of Banyu Lungu, Nangu Ningalanda Finoshan Chan Pama weaknesses, Balungu still will call me and will still have a conversation. So that is something new. That is something new. Balungu, people that he, he could not talk to before, he's talking to them. He's talking to them once ever that there are a lot of people that messed up Lungu. Eh? There are a lot of people that messed up Lungu. Some of them called him corrupt. Some, but Lungu is talking to them. So this is a new Lungu. This is a new Lungu. So from my point of view, once if you I mean, we are still young. We are still growing. Our time will come. What I can just say to all these other politicians, Avena Kasondemwenda, Avena Nankane, Sean Tembo, relax. Relax. Our time will come. Our time will come. Let us relax. Let us give chance to this man. Let him come, put the country in order, put the country back on track, and then we can come back in and do our politics. We need Valungu, and one of the things that we, should, we need to do, number one, is to unite Zambia. We need a leader that is going to unite Zambia. Number two, we need a leader that is going to work on the constitution, such that we remove some of these issues, which make the political landscape 
uh, unfavorable for others. So we need to sort it out. That can only be sorted out through the Constitution. And Balumbu can come and help with that. And he has got only five years. So he's the best person. Not to go to Kavike Power 10 years. Uh -uh. Balumbu in five years. After five years, we can, we can open the, 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 the floodgates now. And we do our politics. So let us have Balungu Bane. That is my 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 issue. And uh, and really uh, for the democracy, it's better we have somebody that has got experience. Now uh, you can call in, you can start calling in again and give me uh, ama, ama questions. Now Londa Sana Ishala and the Sana pa 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 ma questions. If you've that, enjoyed which today's come, content, which will follow have you subscribed up. yet? So you can call the number that you're calling. Subscribing, liking, zero, and seven, sharing six, three, are the keys to becoming three, an zero, integral part of our two, growing two, family. Zero, seven, Hit that subscribe button, zero, seven, give us a thumbs six, up, three, and don't forget to share the love three, with your zero, friends and family. Two, two, Stay tuned for the next video dropping tomorrow. Thank you for being a part of Wilson's YouTube family. Hello? Yes, Mandala. Mm. Mandala, I think uh, this time around you've got it all wrong. Mm. You see, this thing of um, thinking with emotions is not going to help you in any way. Mm. Well, from my analysis, I think what is happening right now is that uh, you are just frustrated and then you are worried about the crimes that you committed in the... You were having committed the mass crimes that you were having in Africa and you were having to do it. And this is why I'm not trying to do it. This time I've committed.